come back. So, oh yes. I was murdering both the Soviets and the English at the same time, that's right. Oh, look at that, my planes are finally engaging them. I'm just beating the shit out of these guys. Oh, yeah. oh my god, look at, oh my god, look at how many fucking bombers I shot down there. Alright, let's move these guys up. No reason for them to just be sitting there. I think I'll move these guys up over here, too. support attack. Th Actually, no. Wait a second. If I attack there, then I can get over the river. That'll be helpful. Alright. Yeah. Actually, let's just have those guys support attack. Attack with HQs before I move up. That's why I do support attack with HQs. Damn it. HQs move faster than infantry. Oh well. Let's push them back again. Fuck, look at all the guys I have there. Jesus Christ. Fine. The fall of London. As the first German scout units advanced into the city, the chimes of Big Ben echo throughout the desert streets of London. The sound is soon drowned out by sporadic small arms fire, and before long the bell itself is forever silenced by a German tank round from Panzer III, probably. I don't know, I don't think I have Panzer IVs yet. Yeah, just Panzer III's. Fallschirmjägers storm Buckingham Palace. If, uh, this, if the Germans have been commanding it. But the royal family has already been evacuated well in advance of the attack. Bloody cowards. Still the Union Jack is lowered by the German flag hoist and the German flag hoisted in its place. London has fallen. God save the king. Not really. Yeah, I'll just let them have Newport. That's a useless port anyway. Even though it's new. Yeah, I'll just attack down the road. I don't have any fucking fuel, fine. <laughs> yep, we're completely annihilating them. English have no goddamn manpower to speak of. They're like the polar opposite of the of the Soviets. Well actually no they're not. They're they're just as shitty as the Soviets, but they uh <laughs> but they have no numbers, so they're like just a weak uh country like Poland. Oh my god, look at all these fucking guys that they're just spamming over here. It's not even fun. I mean, it's like these assholes just love sending massive amounts of guys just to die. You know, it's just ridiculous. I mean, why do they have to sacrifice their fucking men so goddamn much? I mean, seriously, do they even care? Do they even care? I, I'm gonna look at the goddamn losses, because I, I know these fucking bastards have lost a lot of men. Yeah, look at those fucking losses. Look at those fucking losses! Good lord! I've only lost like 42 in IC and 7 in manpower. They've lost a thousand in fucking manpower in IC. God damn you fucking Stalin, you're such an asshole. <laughs> fucking bastard, just sending sending young boys off to die for nothing. <sighs> yeah, that's right. Oh, you sons of bitches. Move up with a fucking cavalry division. Die, you sons of bitches. I bet these guys are gonna break through to count us anyway. Fire organization, yeah, I probably wanna do something with that. Okay. Yeah, let's get jet engines. Researched. Reinforcements are right there. All right, let's uh, let's move them out. I think these guys. Oh, these guys aren't even attached to anything. All right, I'll, I'll just get rid of all these useless HQs if I find any more of them. Yeah, let's move these five guys over to. Uh, yeah, we need a lot more troops over here. I'm gonna make a big push over by here. I'm gonna. This is gonna be my fallback line essentially. All right, these guys are moving up there. These mountaineers. Are there any mountains over here that I can, uh. 
They're pretty good in forests, mountaineers. Yeah, there's nothing really over there. I'll just move them over in the forest. Let's move them over to uh, here. Sweezany. Okay. Is this being used for any? Oh, that's the uh, mountaineer troop. Adam's controlling the uh, two infantry divisions. I'll just move him over to here. Level is he? Uh, he's still level three. Probably hasn't even seen that much action. He's just a chief of staff asshole. Oh yeah, we gotta assign these guys to the Barbarossa HQ, of course. All right, let's move all these guys over there. Well, probably enough troops for that spot right there. I'll probably need those two tank divisions to go up there as well. Why don't I move these guys down? Um, well, actually, I think the Hungarians can probably handle these guys. Let me, uh, let's see here. What do, what do I need? I think I should probably move. No. Hmm. I think I'll move these guys over here. Might as well finish off um, developing the various guys that are going to move in various spots, you know. Just uh, to get a major defensive line going, because right now I'm getting pushed back from the uh, evil Soviets. <laughs> what are those guys doing? Oh, is only Brommer being moved over there? Oh, that's weird. Oh, I see. Yeah, I see what's going on there. Okay. Now all of them should move. Are those guys... Yeah, those are the guys. Those are the guys. Alright, move these guys over to here. And Dally, when he sees all these troops over here, he's going to realize that it, this is not going to be the cakewalk he thought it was going to be. Guess I'll move these guys over here to defend the uh, airfield. And these guys, I guess I'll move over here and make them the new uh, HQ for that. And these two guys, I'll make them part of a new... Oh man, Von Kuchler, he's a really great general. Alright, I'll put Von Falkenhausen commanded those two guys. I'll move Steiner and Rendulik over to the uh, northern side. Let's move them over here, that's probably place where we need the most uh, tank divisions. Alright, that should be good enough. Yeah, when I get these guys over here, that should really uh, buffer a lot of the problems that I'm ha- a lot of the problem places where I'm having a lot of uh, setbacks. Yeah, let's move these guys down there. Guys, move on. Sitting on your asses and doing nothing. Yeah, just sit there, let them get annihilated. These three units will get destroyed. Oh, you sons of bitches, you're still pu pushing me back. No longer. I will not let them push me back from here. That's for goddamn sure. This is the fallback line. Not one step back from here. I'm going to keep fighting them. You fucking assholes are not going to get through there. Alright, they're pushing me back there. That's okay. Good. You sons of bitches think you're going to win that fucking fight. can't trade with them because um, it would open up my uh, transports up to attack, so I can't really do that right now. Monster. Oh, yeah. Yeah, see, those units got destroyed. Yeah, they push them back there. I guess I'll have the uh, have these guys help uh, attack. Alright, good. I wonder if the Soviets have dissent. That might make sense, because I think when you declare war and you're not like a totalitarian dictatorship, your your dissent actually goes up. Technically, the Soviet Union is a totalitarian dictatorship, but I guess that isn't what they had in mind. Hope that HQ doesn't get attacked, but it probably will.
Yes, 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 yes. You push me back over and over and over again for no purpose whatsoever other than to just get a couple bits of territory, and then I push you back with an overwhelming force that will destroy a th that would destroy a thousand suns. Well, maybe a thousand models of suns, but whatever. The important thing is, is that I'm beating them. Yeah, technically, I'm winning this war, even though they, am pu they are pushing me back up in the north. The only reason for that is that they have a lot of goddamn troops up there, and I just need to get into a better defensive spot so I can push them back and then start getting their morale to go backwards. Let's see... Yeah, I should have all those guys attack there. I guess I'll have these guys support from this side. Might as well just have a move. There we go. That should help. Yes, 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 yes. But the good thing about this is that I finally uh been able to push them back a little bit, so now I'm gonna I'm gonna start beating the shit out of them. And now finally my reinforcements have arrived. Let's save here because I'm extremely careful after that goddamned horrific fucking loss of data where I lost the goddamn recording. Or I tried to record before and I actually lost the goddamn thing. Yes, that's right. Attack my fucking tank division right as soon as it captures the spot, you assholes. What are they doing? Oh, they're trying to push through. It's gonna be very different now. <laughs> you fucking cowards. Oh, that's interesting. They're not actually ordering any attacks over there. All right, let's let's just air intercept over there with the you know, planes. They think that they're gonna bomb my goddamn troops without me doing anything about it. They are sorely mistaken. Oh shit! They're gonna fucking fires of their own. Alright, I've got a massive amount of troops over here. I need to break through. Let's do a support attack and all the rest of it. Oh, I need to support attack over there. Let's attack these guys just to keep the pressure off of these guys. Won that battle very handily. I knew they would do that. Alright, I think I'm gonna move my fleet over there, considering that the uh, English do not really pose that much of a threat anymore. I'm gonna go destroy the Soviet fleet with my new Bismarck interprets as well. Yeah, not just heavy cruisers that managed to kill battleships. We have fucking real battleships of our own now. They are very strong battleships, I might add. They may as well be super heavies. Yeah, support the attack. Let's push these guys back into this pocket. Get rid of their advance. Nice. Excellent. Alright, here come the reinforcements. They are desperately needed. Production's a little estranged. Oh wow, I got a lot of upgrades to do. It's probably because of these all, all these damn doctrines and uh, things that I'm developing. I think I'm capturing so goddamn many supplies, I don't even need to build supplies. Must be capturing a lot of supplies from the uh, English and maybe the Soviets too. Well, you sons of bitches, you're still raiding my convoys. <sighs> into the same fleet. Let's get rid of some of these uh, useless ships. I, I'm gonna get rid of the destroyers. They're just, they're just useless. Yeah, these really weak destroyers. They're really, they're really weak. They're, they're really useless. Mm, I actually probably should have uh, just, just done this. But yeah, those those super weak destroyers. They they practically die instantly. So I might as well just leave them. 
Here, I'll just leave one guy in command of that. I guess I'll have him, like, just sit there in port. Don't want to send off destroyers just to die. Alright, let's go destroy the Soviet Navy. I'm gonna make the Bismarck the pride. Bismarck gets ten more experience. I I'll get two descent if the Bismarck is sunk. What the hell? It got sunk in the real in real in the real war, but what the hell? I highly doubt it's gonna get sunk this time around. Especially since I'm doing so goddamn well. I don't know why I sound like a smoker all of a sudden, but whatever. <laughs> Why you sons of bitches, you're just focusing on that one goddamn tank division, aren't you? Well, you were not gonna fucking push through it, I guarantee you. Yeah, that's what I thought, you fucking cowards. Just gonna brutalize this goddamn place. That's right. Oh, you're still attacking me, eh? I don't think so. Oh, there's Steiner. Oh, I moved him up so far he didn't even get to, uh, help. That's okay. Now let's move these guys all the way up to there. Yeah, yeah, now I have fucking troops, you goddamn Soviets. It's time for you to get fucking pushed back, you sons, sons of bitches. Look at all these goddamn men. I'm just gonna smash the living shit out of them. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, that's some real fucking infantry right there, you bat you goddamn assholes. I think you're so fucking tough. Hiding behind all your goddamn troops. even a goddamn fight. Countess is just a goddamn tough nut to crack, isn't it? I only won the goddamn Battle of Bristol over here. I completely forgot about the goddamn English front. Shit. I haven't even done anything over here. They've just gone into defensive positions and everything. Oh shit, hoping I lost the battle. That's what happened there. Let's see. Uh, he's gonna attack, so we'll just have him sit there and try to defend. Alright, good. Now I'm gonna try to force them down into Penzance and try to get rid of their troops. Alright, I captured those ports, now they can't even use those against me. Move these guys up here and have them go off to Fort William. Yep, the English are on their last legs. They have got no more victory points in the British Isles other than one in Ireland, but it's not very useful. And they are extremely close to surrendering. They're 81% towards it. Have the Italians actually made any progress? Nope. What about over here? Nope. What about the Japanese? Well, as far as I can tell, well, they've made a lot of progress in taking over the Dutch stuff, but they haven't really made that much progress over here. Like they haven't even taken over Singapore. They have managed to take back this stuff, though. We'll give them that. Looks like the Australians aren't doing anything. Wow, look at the look at the Japanese go. They're actually attacking them. Not very effectively, but uh They're doing something, I must admit. Yeah, look at that. <laughs> Almost all of Britain has been taken over already. Only after a couple of months of fighting too. Fucking bastards are so weak. They're not even worth the point of me. Alright, Rommel. Break through those guys. Uh, we finally won that goddamn battle after losing like a thousand men. Alright, they lost like two thousand. True Soviet battle. Waste all of your men for nothing. Good job, guys. You lost the fucking town. shouldn't actually do that. Alright, let's just move them back. All right. Okay, and what I was going to do is I was going to have the uh, Kriegsmarine patrol around and try to kill off the... Oh, there it is. There's a sub. Oh, we're finally fighting the Soviet fleet. Oh my god, they're going to get completely annihilated. Look at that. They have no organization for most of their ships. 
And the only two real battleships they have are fucking horrible. They got the Marat and the some goddamn thing. They even got subs. Oh my god, look at that. Look at how many ships I've sunk. Oh my god. I've lost like no ships. The only things that are getting attacked are the Oh my god. No no Slicen. Oh my god, I just sunk their pride. Did Slicen get sunk? Oh fuck. I almost did. I sunk the rat. Oh my god, I sunk them all. Oh my god! I destroyed three of their destroyers, both of their battleships. Beautiful! And the Schleisen didn't even get sunk. It's a fucking World War I battlecruiser. A piece of shit, and it didn't get sunk. Wonderful. How many how many goddamn kills did the Bismarck get? I'm gonna, I'm gonna look at who killed the uh, the battleships. Let me see here, which ship sunk? Where is that? Ship sunk, where are you? Ship sunk, ship sunk. My favorite tab. There it is. Alright, let's look down here and look at the Soviet Union deaths. Ah, uh, yes. Sunk by the Schleisen, oh, how nice. The Nuremberg. The Tirpitz got one of the battleships. And the Marat was sunk by the Bismarck, how nice. That's its first kill. Transportation, yeah, definitely don't need that anymore. All right, I'll get get the large re um, large formations thing. Might as well have it. It'll help my uh, research out. It's always a good idea just to research just for the hell of it. Sometimes. All right, let's move these guys up and finish these fucking bastards off. Non-aggression pact status. Oh, Vichy France. Oh, I can actually take over Vichy France, apparently, because I only have a non-aggression pact with them. Ah, <laughs> uh, they're attacking my, fir my uh, HQ before it can be reinforced. Fuckers. What are they doing now? Oh, I pushed up with that massive infantry assault, now they're pushing up with a fucking motorized division that doesn't even have full... Oh, and now I've got all my guys in that one spot. Yeah, you did not win that fucking battle. You, oh, come on! 57%? How the fuck can they be winning that? That's ridiculous. I've got... Oh, wait, that's theirs? Oh, shit, I didn't even realize that. Never mind. Well, as soon as these guys start attacking, though... Oh, what did I lose? Just something down there or something. Where is it? Oh, they're pushing around or some goddamn thing. Oh, come on, you stupid Hungarian bastards. Attack Look at all those fucking men they got right there. They could push right through that line, even though they got tanks. Yeah, I probably do need more tank divisions down there. Maybe I do need to move Steiner down there, actually, and the other guys, whatever their names are. I don't have any tanks over here. I'm just fighting infantry, and they've got a shitload of tanks. Well... Oh, shit, this unit is surrounded. Well, I could get a, uh... I think I can get, uh, transit rights. Oh, they won't, they won't accept it. A bunch of assholes. Declare war on them. <laughs> I would if I could, but unfortunately I can't. Oh, the National Spanish one. Oh, supplies, how nice. I'm gonna save here. It's always a good thing to save. Always save if you can. It'll mean everything in the long run. Trust me. <laughs> Alright, those guys are finally starting to move up. Actually, wait a second, are they? No, I don't think they are. No, they're not. Okay. Oh, find your targeting for focus. That's good. That's a great ability to have. It makes your uh, fighters much more efficient against uh, other planes. It makes them go after the right, uh... Oh, right. Yeah, maybe this is something that I should probably, uh... Oh. Yeah, what the hell. 
Technically, I would make them go after the fighters mostly, because if you take out the fighters and they have no s air support, and then you can just decimate all the, uh, all the, all the planes, you know. And go start researching heavy tank stuff. I do want to build heavy tanks, because they're probably going to be the most useful unit to, uh, equip my infantry divisions with, because that'll give them massive, uh, ta anti-tank. And, uh, it'll really upgrade them in a lot of ways. And not only that, but the uh, but the he heavy tanks move just as fast as infantry, so um, so they're perfect. Oh come on! Support that attack, will you? Thank you. Oh, come on! How can they be losing? All right, when are these guys finally gonna attack? Forty hours? Are you serious? All right, fine, move back. How could they lose so goddamn much morale just from that one thing? I almost feel like demoting him. Oh, are they really gonna move up? No, they're not gonna move up. Good God, look at all the tanks the damn Soviets have. They just got so many of them. Jesus Christ. This, then they'll be finished. Moving up. Keep moving up. Yeah, I love it. They're not even bothering to try to fight over here. They're just moving back and forth. They're gonna, not only are they going to lose these guys, but they may even lose their ships. I think sometimes you actually end up destroying ships sometimes when you uh, capture places that have ships or uh, planes. Oh my god, look at all this infantry I have right there. I should definitely push through. Yeah, that's the end of that bullshit. God, what the fuck was that battle? Oh yeah. Very bloody. I hate bloody battles, they're so fucking nasty. <laughs> yeah, that's right, attack my units right as soon as they come into the guy. Oh, he's attacking one tank division with two. As soon as these guys move up, they should be able to counter them. Okay. Oh yeah, I should definitely move these guys up. Got hardly anything over there. Oh yeah, don't move up there. Falling apart yet, that's the only good sign. Let's attack these guys. Go push around Minsk and take it over. Oh, look at that. Oh, sons of bitches. Even though the Hungarians are attacking them. Oh yeah, I should probably attack these guys too. Yeah, there we go. That'll push them back. How are we doing against the English? That's right. Tight my tank division with HQ is a fool. Assholes. Unless they can magically transport them. Yep, they've already moved their ships away. They know they know they'll get captured if they leave them there. This is sort of a risky spot I have here though, I must admit. I should try to push him back with what I've got. 
Did he capture all of that? Okay. Well, this is looking pretty good. I mean, it's a lot slower than the English front, of course, because the Soviets have so goddamn many troops, and I don't have very many men either. Yeah, I've only got like 300,000. I think they've probably got at least a million or more. Probably not that many, but, you know, quite a few. Okay, that's the end of that bullshit over there in Wales. Alright, why don't we move... Actually, those two tank divisions can handle those guys. Let's just move them up here to get rid of... Actually, wait a second. I'm beating these guys back. Why don't I just detach all of these guys and move them over to Lois Toft and make and uh and let's tra let's let's transfer them over to the Eastern Front. Let's let's transfer these guys. We don't need these guys anymore. We've got plenty of guys already fine. Oh yeah, that's right. Use your naval bombers to attack my fucking HQs. <sighs> oh my god, look at that attack. HQ before it moves up, of course. <laughs> you fucking bastards. Oh well. Let's see. Uh, what should I do? I should probably move these guys back because they're going to get slaughtered. It's a massive amount of tank divisions. <laughs> Instantly captured my ass. Goddamn Soviets just have way too many troops. I mean, they really shouldn't have this many. I mean, they didn't have this many to begin with. I mean, 1940, they, they did not have this many goddamn troops, I can tell. There's just way too many fucking troops on this line. Yeah, that's not gonna do very well. Fuck. I was counting on that tank division, too, to be well equipped enough to counterattack, but I guess not, considering they've got, like, no organization. Yeah, that just is going to end in a massive slaughter. Yeah, just don't, don't even bother. Infantry probably won't even help. Yeah, let's let them push push forward enough with too few troops and then try to catch them in a massive uh, encirclement over there. Oh yeah, I really need to move these guys up. God damn, I've got so many men over here. I don't know where to really go, except they're over there. Let's just attack me. So. Oh, too low of infrastructure, eh? Alright, fine. Oh yeah, we really need to push these guys up too. Uh, what was that? No, it's not okay. I'd also like to remind you that uh, I'm doing this in the middle of spring and uh, and winter <laughs> instead of summer, like when the uh, Germans historically invaded and they were just able to walk over everything. Oh, and they also invaded. They didn't get invaded by the Soviets and then pushed them back epically like I am. While well, they're fighting the English and taking them over, something also that didn't happen in real life. Okay, is the Bismarck finally upgraded? Rather, uh, yeah, it's almost repaired. That's good. I'll send it back out and kill off the rest of the uh, Russian fleet. Let's get these guys up. Get these guys up. Get these guys support an attack. That's right, you fucking cowards. Attack every goddamn unit I have, no matter what the hell it is, no matter where the hell it is. Alright, good, we're pushing those guys out. Hopefully the uh, Hungarians will actually help me. Should probably save here, because it's starting to lag a little bit. Yeah, they're still trying to move over there. They still have not moved over there. Fucking idiots. Can't even move one goddamn troop. And I've already taken over practically all of got all the goddamn English. I'm 83% away from losing. Hey, the Italians finally pushed up. Oh, they're actually trying to take Cairo. Good. Well, once they take Cairo and they finally get over the Nile, that that will be the end of the English and the in the in the Egyptian front. What are the damn Nepalese doing? Screw them. God damn it. Fucking Japanese. Why the hell are they taking so long just to invade Singapore? They conquered it so goddamn fast in real life. Well, at least they've taken over pretty much all the Dutch East Indies. 
Or is that actually the West Indies? I can't remember wh which way it goes. I believe it's West Indies for the, uh... I can't remember. I can't remember if Indonesia is the East Indies or West Indies. I believe it's the West Indies, or East Indies, actually. spotted a great way to beat the shit out of these guys. Yeah. Look at all those HQs. Oh wow, I killed a lot of guys in that one battle there. Wow, look at how fast I'm pushing up here. Alright, let's beat the shit out of these guys over here. Good. Oh man, fucking uh, assholes! Dare you fight back? What? Oh, they moved over. Who cares? I'll probably kill them anyway because they moved over. Uh, even more stuff that they're taking from me. But I'll quickly take back, of course, because they're idiots and they always move up before they're ready. these guys support the attack over there. Yeah, I think I'm doing the best in the f in the north. The uh, the south is pretty much a stalemate. It's more of a World War One fight than any anything. But uh, yeah, once I finish off England and uh, maybe even Ireland, maybe I'll make a pit stop and destroy Ireland as well as uh, England. I I'll definitely end this uh, stupid assault. Oh come on, those are HQs. Yeah, that's right. Kill them off. Yeah, you can really abuse the shit out of that thing where where the HQs automatically get destroyed. Because if the HQs are, like, defending a, uh, a surrounded spot, they'll get completely annihilated instantly. So, it's a nice abuse. Especially for the shit that the English pull on me over and over and over again, where they take over stuff that they shouldn't be allowed to take over. Oh, come on! Italy has all these goddamn troops just sitting in Italy. Look at all those guys in fucking Taranto. Good lord. You're just letting those goddamn special guys die. Oh, that's right. Before I can move all my guys over there, you gotta attack my HQs and make them retreat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Idiots. Wait a minute, wait a minute. No. Damn it. Only the HQ is fighting there. God damn it. Fix your goddamn supply train fucking Germany already? Come on. Bullshit. I need to fucking make attacks, not just sit on my ass and wait for you to build up your goddamn oil reserve. use the guys that are in Scotland for a defense. Well, actually, wait a second. If I move these guys up, and then, uh, yeah, let's do that. So let's, uh, let's deselect this, and then move all these guys up there. Yeah, let's not move them up with the guys that are going over to the eastern front just yet. Let's move them over here and, uh, take over this place. I need to move my, uh, transports over anyway so they can take over, uh, Northern Ireland. I think I'm going to want to move my ships back. Yeah. Let's move them to, uh, what would be the best place to invade from? Probably this. I think I'll move my guys over here. Pembroke. Move my transports to after my uh, main ships move up, of course.
Alright, I think these guys are almost ready to uh, be transported back into uh, the Eastern Front. I think they want to fight on the Eastern Front, don't you think so? I think, I think they do. Alright guys, you're gonna be put right here, right on the fucking front line! What do you think of that? English Channel, how nice. Wow, our descent change goes down by 10%, our leadership modifier goes up by 10%, that's amazing. Oh my god, I don't even have to fucking deal with consumer goods now, Jesus Christ, look at that! Beautiful! I don't even have to bother with consumer goods, because my descent change is so goddamn low. That's beautiful. Alright. Beautiful. Wonderful. Oh my god. My industrial capacity is 354? Oh my god! I just have as much IC as the goddamn Soviets now. Wonderful. Alright, I think I definitely should start building up some stuff until I... Well, I, I think I need to upgrade first. I think, I think I've think i developed my tank my tanks enough that I'm about to actually get some uh, better tanks, like uh, Panzer IVs and stuff like that. I wonder if any of my guys have actually upgraded yet. Infantry, infantry level 5 still. Oh, Carabiners 43, yeah, that's really nice. I got pack 40s too. That historically is what the anti-tank gun that we actually had during this time in the war. And we've even got fucking pack 43s. 88. Wonderful. No, oh, we still got shitty armor. It's level 3. Yeah, well, well, yeah, well, at least we got, um... <coughs> at least we got, uh, guys with semi-automatic rifles. Fucking Soviets don't have that. They're probably still using the goddamn Osinogand. Piece of shit. Not even as much killing power as the goddamn car. Shittiest fucking bolt I've ever seen on a gun. Then again, it was a pretty old gun that I shot. <laughs> Piece of shit anyway. You know, sometimes you can sort of tell, you know, when something's just, just a plain piece of shit. You know, you know, you know, it just sucks. You know, you know that you could probably give it a better chance, but it probably isn't even worth it because even if you did, you probably just see it, how much of a piece of shit it really is. You ever, you, ever, you, ever, you know that feeling? You know, it's like when you think that you're going to give something a good chance, but then you don't, and then you realize, oh, it didn't really matter anyway because the thing sucked to begin with. Yeah, that's what I thought about when I shot the most inaugurant one time. <laughs> Not my favorite experience. Of course, I don't like any bolt actions anyway. I think they're stupid. I think lever actions are a hell of a lot better. Oh yes, that's right. Trap my fucking infantry, you assholes. You're gonna get pushed right the fuck back. That is right. You are gonna be attacked by every goddamn division in the German army. Ah, wonderful. Surprise, assholes! That's the end of that shit. Alright, now. Let's make all these guys joined up with the... Oh, that's useless. Oh, wait a second. No, it's not. I need to... I need to make these guys detached. And then, uh, attach them to something else. Attach these guys to that, I guess. These guys I'll attach to, uh, I wish you could attach all of them to just one spot, but I can't really do that. Alright, we'll just do it the slow way, I guess. Yeah, those guys need to be attached to a different one. Yeah, move them over there. Alright, is this attached to anything else? Yeah, it is. Let's just attach them to the closest one. Good. Alright, that'll probably fix my, uh, supply line problems now. Okay. And now, we're going to attach all these guys to this one. <laughs> I think the Soviets are feeling the heat now. I think they realize that the gloves are off, and I am sending every goddamn troop to attack them, even if it probably would be a better idea for me to keep them back. Yeah, I just want to kill them so fucking bad, that's the thing. Once you kill the Soviet Union, you pretty much win the goddamn war. I mean... I, I, I've destroyed the Soviet Union one time when I played as Germany, and I swear to God, I mean, I was so powerful. I had like 700 IC. 
<laughs> and I could support like 70 technology programs. I mean, I was like practic I, I practically was the world at that point in time. You know, I mean, can you even imagine both the Soviet Union and Germany being under control of Germany? Oh, and England as well? <laughs> yeah. Why did the fucking Hungarians lose that fight? Oh, come on, are you really... <sighs> You're just gonna let me get trapped, aren't you? Fools. Well, I actually can go back, because the Hungarians have actually moved up far enough, so that's good. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, why are you guys moving up? Aren't you just support attacking? Isn't that what you're doing? Right? Right? <laughs> Aren't you just a support attacking, or are you actually doing other stuff, too? Damn it. Fuck. I didn't even realize that was happening. Shit. Oh, god damn it! I, look, I got all those fucking guys down there! Bitch. Damn it. Stupid assholes. Oh, good. I actually won the battle, so I can keep my HQs there. Excellent. Now I'll just... Oh, fuck. The game's starting to die. Or is it? Oh, my God. I think it just crashed. Oh, shit. <sighs> right before everything, too. Come on. Come on, game. Don't crash on me. Come on. It's not that big of a deal. Come on. Just... Ah. <sighs> Alright, I'll stop.